Hello everybody, my name is Maddie, and welcome back to another episode of our Sims 3 Lucid Legacy Leprosy Challenge. Wow, that's kind of a mouthful. And today we are hopefully just going to spend the day with, you know, the Sakamoto family and kind of see how it goes. See if we maybe get engaged. That's kind of the plan. I know, like, we just started dating in the last episode, but they've almost been together for, like, a whole summer season, kind of. So, I'm just ready to start having babies, y'all. I am so ready to start having some children in this game, okay? Very excited. And I'm also playing with a brace today. I've never played Sims with a brace or used much of a computer with a carpal tunnel brace but we are going to try and we'll see how it goes speaking of sam uh not sam that's his son of layton i'm so sorry speaking of layton we are getting woken up by him to talk to him you know what yeah let's talk to him maybe he's calling us to kind of be like yo do you want to go to the beach today um there are a lot of wild horses on this slot which might be great when Leighton moves in because like I said I want him to ride horses and I want him to be a jockey so I'm actually kind of happy that there's a whole bunch of wild horses because we might not need to buy one I don't know I've never adopted a wild horse that's something I've never done in the sims 3 because if it's possible I'm pretty sure it's incredibly difficult so Yes, it's very interesting, very interesting. Um, eat some cereal, and then how's the garden? Because I just had her take care of the garden yesterday when I played off camera because she slept literally till like 2 o'clock in the afternoon, so there was not really any point, any need to film, so, you know. But I guess we'll take care of the garden and then take a shower, and then we'll go to the beach in this, this afternoon. So, that's the plan. Okay, I don't know where the day went, but it's literally 5 o'clock now, and we still never made it to the beach, and now it's raining! Great! Absolutely fantastic. So my plans for the final day of summer have been ruined. So maybe we'll just go to Tiny, tiny Prodigies. Maybe we can just go here and see if his family will come and hang out with us. Um, looks like he might be at work, right? He has that annoying job. But right, just for right now, he only has that annoying job of right now. So, you know what? Let's maybe invite Yumi. We'll go over there and, oh, I didn't mean to. Sorry. Whoopsies. We'll go over and, uh, no, let's go to their house. You know, let's go to the house and hang out with Sam and Yumi while he is at work. Maybe we'll see him when he gets back from work. I don't know what days he has off because it feels like in The Sims they never have the day off. But uh, I don't know. Oh, a deer. I love The Sims 3. Look at that. Oh, how cute. Anyway. And you guys need to take a good look at this house because before long they will be moving on to the farm yes yes they will let's go give him some baby food hello and then we're gonna talk to yumi just like hang out with her today i know we like literally just saw her yesterday but we'll act like it's been a few days okay because you know this is the sims and so time goes by super super quickly i don't know why i clicked ask her if she's single um it's just it's a reflex you guys it's a reflex Okay, and she says that we can sleep over tonight, which is great. So that means we'll definitely get to talk to Leighton tonight whenever he gets back from work. We're just going to hang out with Sam, you know, kind of get to know him a little bit because we don't know Sam very much. And I want us to be, I want her to be close with him, especially because she's close with Yumi and Leighton. So Sam is the next person we need to get close with. It looks like Amit is already a toddler. Wow, he grew up so fast. Uh, we really need to start having babies because I want them to, I want a baby. I want them to have children together. Yes, we need to have children. Um, we'll put him in the crib and maybe is there something, oh, there's some autumn salad we can eat. Or you know what, why don't you, nope, don't have anything in the fridge. Right, I was going to say, what if you cooked dinner for them? Okay, it's 9 o'clock. Layton, you should be on your way home now. Come on, boy. Where are you? Oh, here he is. 
oh no, I could be asked to watch the stars. No, 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 no. We'll totally go watch the stars with you. Even though it's raining, so I don't know how good of a view the stars are going to be tonight. But he's asking us to watch the stars with him. So let's go and do that. Oh, on the back porch tonight. Okay. Look at them. Oh, they're so cute. They're so stinking cute. I can't wait for their babies. <laughs> Alrighty, now they're being a little flirty. I'm trying to see if I can get the, get the prompt from a Deep Conversations mod where he proposes to her, but it doesn't always, oh, very alluring. So maybe I just need Deep Conversations to pop up. And for once, it's not being annoying and like, hey, 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 hey. Like, look at me, look at me, click on me, click on me. Like, it's not doing that for once, even though now I want it to. Come on, deep conversations. Come on. We are on a, ooh, I love you. Yes. Um, well, if you're willing to take a shot with me, sure, let's try it. Oh, here we go. This is not where I thought this would be happening. But, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. We are getting proposed to, oh my god, that is the ugliest background for this type of situation. <laughs> Um, it's okay. You know, he's a single dad who lives with his mom. I'm not expecting, I'm not expecting like a fancy location or anything. No, 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 no. That would be ridiculous. Yay! Oh, yay! She said yes. Very good, very good, Eden. Great. Okay, so now they're engaged. And it's like, would it be... Would it be too soon if they woohooed and tried for a baby? Hmm. Be honest. Would it be too soon? Um, oh, yay. Okay. Um, make out. Because she does actually want to make out with him. So, <clears throat> apologies. I have had something in my throat for, like, all week. So, I don't, I don't know. They can now get married at a wedding party or a private wedding. I think I want them to have a wedding party, of course. I don't know if I want them to get married, like, okay, you know what? Let's, let's risky woohoo. Let's risky woohoo. And, oh, look, two, today, two people have gotten married. So, maybe Leighton just kind of felt in the mood to propose because all of their friends are getting engaged and married, and he wants that next step as well. So, he just decided to propose to Eden tonight. And, obviously, she said yes, and, <clears throat> ooh, a bachelorette party. Sure, we can definitely throw one of those. And now they're going to woohoo in the shower. Okay, risky woohoo. I don't know if she's going to get pregnant. We will have to uh, wait and see. I just, I really want to start having kids because babies are so great in this game. I love, I love little Sim babies so much. Someday we look at stars in distant sky When I'm on the other side Alrighty, let's go ahead to bed with him. There's no, there's no other... There's no other bed here. So let's go to sleep and I will see you all in the morning. Okay. <laughs> Poor little Sam here has been awake for a few hours crying and nobody in this house has gotten up to take care of him. So Eden is just going to wake up a little bit early and she, like, she hears him. Okay. Maybe, you know, Sam. He went to bed really late. They both went to bed late, but he ended up eating and doing the dishes. So she was just like, I can take care of him. Don't worry. I got you, boo. I got you. So she's going to take care of Sam and uh, change his diaper, change his outfit, wake him up, get him some food, you know, stuff like that. Basic motherly duties. And I don't know when Sam ages up. Is today his birthday, Sam? When do you become a child? I'm asking because, uh, um, oh, today is his birthday. Sweet. That's great. That is great. Okay, let's give him a little bottle and I want to make breakfast, but you don't have anything in your house. <sighs> Guys, I want to make breakfast. Come on. We don't have any eggs and I don't really want her to like 
run and get eggs at the store because that would take too long. Dang it, I need to get chickens for the house. I have chickens in my game. And if we had chickens, we could make breakfast. But instead, we're just going to... Okay, let's not... Maybe we won't eat their cereal. We'll eat their cereal, not their salad. I tweeted at Twitter today. I had to reactivate my three-year-old Twitter account to be like, Yo, YouTube, do you think you could give me my live streaming back? Because I would really like to live stream. So maybe something will come out of that and I might be able to do some streams where I play this family. Because I think that would just be super fun. But we'll see. I am not positive on that. I do have my fingers crossed though. Like look, she has this cute little like mother-in-law quarter. And then she's we're going to move to our lot and she's gonna get a shack. Yeah, a shack. Mm-hmm. <gasps> Nauseous. Eden isn't feeling too hot. You may want to keep her around a bathroom from unknown causes. Oh my god, guys, she's pregnant. Risky Woohoo came through this time. That's exciting. We're gonna have our first baby in this series coming very, 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 very soon. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Ah, I I want to, I don't know if I want a boy or I want a girl. I don't know what I want. I usually get boys. I swear all of my Sims always get pregnant with boys. But I kind of think that would be okay for them to have a boy for their first child together. Oh, oh my God, look at them. Oh my goodness, guys. Oh, I'm dying. I'm dying because this is so cute. And it's only so cute because it was unprompted and because she can't teach him to do, teach him how to walk. So this is just like, oh my goodness. Ah, he's like my little baby boy ages up today. Oh, guys, I'm in love. I'm in love with Layton and this whole family. I'm in love with them. Okay, we're going to real quickly, oh, I guess we're going to throw up. I'm going to have her go run out and buy a birthday, okay, she's going to throw up first. But then I want her to go run out and buy a birthday cake because I think maybe we'll go to the park or the beach today. It is 67 degrees, so maybe we can go to the park here and just have a little age him up right there. There's a table. Uh, but we'll come to the park and just have a little birthday party with the family for Sam. Ooh, who's this cute little kid? Sandy. Sandy Torres Eccles because her mom got married. Right. <laughs> right. I forgot about that. Okay. We're buying a little birthday cake. And you know what? Let's get some rainbow sprinklers for him. We'll get him a little birthday present. And, oh wait, no, don't go home, sorry. I clicked home because I'm thinking she's going back to the Sam's, the Sekimoto. Not, I keep calling them the Sam family because Sam Sekimoto, in my mind, it just goes together so well. But no, they're the Sekimoto family, not the Sam family. Sam Sam? No. Even the Sims team wouldn't do that. Well, you know what, maybe Sims 4, maybe the people who work on Sims 4 would do that, but where are you going? Come back. We're having a birthday party. Um, oh, Layton's upstairs. Okay, so let's head into town to the park. I am going to go uh, in RAS, Master Controller, invite over. I'm going to invite over Yui because I don't know where she went, but she cannot escape my powers. It is such a dark and gloomy day. It's like, is my is my lighting mod working? I don't know, but it's such a dark day. Which is kind of sad because it's our little boy's birthday. But what can you do? A blueberry seed. I don't want that, actually. That's fine. Go here and let's blow out Sam Sekimoto's candles. Wait, is Yui here? Are you picking him back up? Wait, is Yui here? Is she going to miss her grandson's birthday? That wasn't the plan, but she had to leave right when I was putting everything together. How dare she do this to me? How dare she? Oh, here she goes. Okay, she's not going to miss the, the party. That's good. Good, 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 good. 
Okay. Yay, little Sam is aging up, and I can't wait to give him a makeover, and she might find out she's pregnant tonight, which is also, like, super exciting. Oh, no. Oh, no. Wait, I don't want to, I want to get a picture, but my, I'm glitching out a little bit over here. Not the game, just myself. <laughs> I'm glitching. Yay! Happy birthday, Sam! Happy birthday, Sam! Happy- Oh, why are you- Yumi, why are you laughing at your grandson? Yumi. Yumi, why are you laughing at your grandkid? Come on, girl. Let's not, please. Okay. Yay! Sam aged up! Let's go greet him. Actually get to talk to him now that he's a- An adult? Whoa. Not an adult. A child. Where'd he go? I want to even make over. I guess we'll greet him after we eat cake. We have priorities, you guys. We have priorities. Come here, boy. Let me give you a makeover. Okay, I understand that, you know, Sam's entire, like, what's the word? Not theme, but gimmick. His whole gimmick is that he's bald, but I don't want him to be bald. I want him to be cute, so he's got hair, you know? He's just, like, his facial features don't fit not having any hair. Um, it did as a toddler. He was cute. But now he's not a toddler. It's not cute. So I gave him some hair. And it's also raining. Again, of course it is. Of course it is. So uh, then I want you to come greet Sam, please, and thank you. Looks like we forgot to change his diaper before he aged up. So whoopsies. Uh, let's congrats his on his birthday let's get to know you know let's also give him a gift of the rainbow sparklers that we bought for him and let's just have some like let's just like get to know him a little bit more because we obviously can't really get to know him that much when he's a toddler so okay friendly hug give a gift. I won't do any more of the deep conversations because that screws up the, the cue I have. <gasps> She's about to throw up again. So she is getting very, oh, let's give him a little, let's take picture, picture, picture. That's not, that's no, not a very good picture actually. Sorry. He's too uh, short. Oh, he's so excited. I hope you liked him. Oh, we said thank you. You are so, so welcome. So welcome, Sam. He's so cute, and he's, like, so pale compared to both Eden and uh, Layton and everyone, but I still think, like, he just looks so much like their son. He's not, but I think he looks very much so like their son. Okay, I want you to come use the bathroom, and then we'll probably head home. Excuse me, Zelda. She needs to pee and then throw up right afterwards at least you didn't oh i guess she couldn't because she was on the toilet i don't know but we're gonna head home we hung out with them for the birthday and yeah she's gonna find out she's pregnant she has to you guys i'm just saying it's gotta be tonight and we gotta move them in because she's literally about to find out she's pregnant so she should, they should probably move in with us, which means I need to like start building their house and I'm not a very good builder. So I'm kind of thinking they might move into the barn for a little bit because <laughs> I'm just, I'm not a very good builder, you guys. And so it would take such a long time for me to build. Okay, let's go to sleep. Elizabeth is a new baby in town. Yes, yes. Oh, okay. Never mind. She just went to bed and now she's got to go run out to the outhouse to throw up. I'm going to sell these flowers for 15 simoleons. We need to head to the consignment store to sell some of our plants. Okay, she's still not found out she's pregnant. What time did they woohoo, you guys? It should be time that you found out she's pregnant, but I guess maybe it was early hours in the next day. Okay, again, geez, this baby is going to put her in a very bad mood. I can already tell because she's about to throw up for the third time today. She's up again at 1.30 to go and throw up once more. Yes, you're doing fantastic, aren't you? 
Then she was going to go look through scrap. Nope, I want you to go back to bed. Okay, you have a very, you don't have a very good, oh, okay, now she's back up at 2.30 to find out she's pregnant. Were they really up that late the previous night? I don't remember. I was not paying attention to the clock. <gasps> there we go. She's pregnant. Yay. What an exciting end to this episode. She's, oh, wait, wait. I want to get a picture. Okay, I got to zoom in now. Make up your mind, game. But what an exciting end to this episode, you guys. I don't know how long or how short it is, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I know it was kind of a little bit hectic because there was so much going on and I didn't really plan on them having a baby before they got married. Maybe they could still get married, like have like a super quick wedding, but I kind of really want them to have a really beautiful wedding. So that might not happen for a little bit because now she's having a bye bye. So yeah, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And um, yeah, goodbye. Hey duo, adios. And I will see you guys on my next video. Do not forget I am still a freaking bulldozer and please cross your fingers for me that I can get live streaming enabled back on my channel. Mwah. Here we are, we locked down in different cities And our virtual connection falls apart Guess it's been too many years since California Now the memory